Thank you for viewing our brief video on how the Sherwood Scuba Amphos Watch computer operates. This video is a short tutorial and is not to be used in lieu of reading the manual. The Amphos features four control buttons to navigate the computer. Mode, Select, Light, and Advance. Unless the computer is operating in one of the dive computer modes, the Amphos will default to watch mode. Within watch mode, pressing the mode button will access or scroll through the other features of watch mode. Alternative time, countdown timer, chronograph or stopwatch, and an alarm. The Amphos also features three dive computer modes as well. Normal mode, which is used for air and nitrox dives, also allows access to fly, log, history, set, and desat screens. A gauge mode, which is used for dives in which nitrogen and oxygen calculations are not performed. This mode will also allow access to fly, log, history, and set screens and a free dive mode used for breath holding activities which has its own group of settings. Let us help you learn how to navigate the Amphos watch computer. From watch mode holding the mode button down for two seconds will take you to normal mode. Holding down mode button again for another two seconds will forward you to the gauge mode. And lastly, pressing the mode button for an additional two seconds will take you to the free diving mode. Once again, we'll return you to normal dive mode. To choose which dive mode you wish to operate in is determined by whether or not the mode name is flashing or solid. Here you'll notice that NOR, normal, is solid. Forwarding to gauge, gauge is blinking indicating that you're on the gauge spring but you have not entered gauge mode. Holding mode down for an additional two seconds you're in free dive screen but because free is blinking, you are not in free dive mode. To set into free dive mode, simply press the mode button once, and now we are in free dive mode. Holding it for two seconds again, you're back to the dive screen, but again, norm is blinking. One press of the mode button will solid the norm, and now you are within normal mode. From the normal screen, by pressing the select and advance buttons simultaneously for longer than two seconds, you move into the set F screen. This is used to set your FO2 settings. Pressing the advance button will move you to your first gas choice. Press the select button and you can now choose the percentage of oxygen you wish to dive with. Press the advance button once your percentage is set and you now can set your second gas. You will notice gas 2 can go up to 100 percent and it returns back to 28 percent. The Amphos computer is programmed to prevent the FO2 of the second gas cannot be lower than the first gas. Pressing the advance button takes you to your default FO2 screen. You can engage this by pressing the select button between on and off. It is important to note that if the default is set to on you must set your FO2 before each dive, otherwise your computer will default to 50%. When set in the off position, 
The previous FO2 setting will remain until changed by the user. Pressing the advance once again completes the set F settings. Pressing select and advance again, you will move to the set A or the alarm section of the settings. Pressing the advance will scroll to audible alarms and you can choose on or off by pressing the select button. Once chosen what you would like, pressing the advance button moves you to the deep alarm. You will see here by pressing select you have on, set, or off. Once choosing set, press the advance and now you will see the depth actually blinking. Now you can choose where you want to set your deep alarm. Pressing advance takes the back to the toggle of on, off, and set. Once you choose what you would like, the advance button is again. The advance button takes you to the EDT or elapsed dive time alarm. Again, using the set button between on, off, and set. Advance allows you to move forward into the time. Select allows you to scroll through. Once you have the number you would like, again advance, select to toggle between on, off, and set, and advance once again moves you now to the nitrogen bar graph alarm. Again, on, off, and set from the select button, advance, now you will notice that the bar graph is actually blinking here and you can adjust the nitrogen bar graph to where you want to be alarmed. Advance toggles back to on, off, and set. And advance takes you to DTR or dive time remaining. Toggle between on, off, and set with the select button. Advance. You can now choose how much dive time remaining you wish. Advance pulls you back out and toggle between on, off, and set. And advance now takes you to the PO2 alarm. On, off, and set. And again, advance gets you in, allows you to choose a PO2 alarm setting. Advance pulls you out, toggle between on, off, and set, and advance once again. You've now completed your alarm section of the settings. Alarm or excuse me, select and advance again simultaneously takes you into set U or your utilities. Pressing the advance button takes you to wet activation. You can toggle between on and off for wet activation. Advance forwards you to the next screen which is your units between imperial and metric. Choose which category. Advance will take you to deep stop Again, on and off, you can choose to keep the deep stop on. Advance forwards you to safety stop. Again, select, you can toggle between them. And you move on to CF, or conservative factor, when you press advance once again. You can choose the conservative factor on or off. Choosing on. Press the advance button once again. And now you are at your duration glow screen. This is where you get to choose how much time your backlight will remain on while once the light button is pressed. So on, off, and set. Choosing set. Pressing advance takes you into the five seconds. Select to ten seconds or five. Advance moves you forward and select to on, off, or set again, and advance uh, moves you forward to the PC sampling. This allows you to set your time of how often you want your Amphos computer to record for your download settings, 15 seconds, 30 seconds, every 60 seconds, or every 2 seconds. And advance will pull you through. That completes the set you portion of the computer. That concludes this portion of the video. Enjoy your new Amphos watch computer and safe diving.